Attorney General Jim Hood makes it official as he signs qualifying papers to run for governor. That's right, WJTV 12's Gerald Harris caught up with all the action and he is, joins us now from the newsroom with more. Gerald? The four-term attorney general, now Democratic candidate for governor, made the announcement at the Mississippi Civil Rights Museum and outlined his platform. With a stroke of a pen, Jim Hood made his candidacy for governor official and signed a pledge to voters. Working families have been kicked to the curb uh, for far too long. And the, one of the ways I think that we could, we could create an opportunity for working families is to roll back the sales tax on food in Mississippi. Hood is making lower taxes and government transparency among his top priorities. I think we need to cut taxes on working people instead of giving it away to large out-of-state corporations. That's what we've been done, doing the last several years. We've got to clean up government. We've got to stop all of this waste that's going on by friends that, uh, you know, by their friends who come in and give campaign contributions to get state contracts. Hood says also making improvements to education is one of his key pledges. From pre-K education uh, to teachers pay to community colleges and our colleges and providing uh, training to our workers. He adds he wants to keep working people at the front and isn't worried about the partisan attacks. This, this is encouraging to see how many Republicans and Democrats encourage me to run for governor. So I see people want to change. He's running in the Democratic primary against former Jackson State employee Valicia Williams, Hines County District Attorney Robert Schuba Smith, and Albert Wilson. Jade.